I welcome you to the third module of this course on Solution Restart in Answers. In this module, we are going to see Solution Restart feature in Answers. In this slide, we are going to see why Solution Restart feature is required. Many large nonlinear FE models take a long time to solve. In many cases, the nonlinear FE models do not completely solve due to solution difficulties. Many such large FE models often have over tens of millions of degrees of freedom. It is prohibitively expensive to start the solution. From the first substep, if the solution does not converge. For example, if a solution takes a total of 10 substeps and 8 substeps converge well, but the 9 substep does not converge, starting the solution from the first substep requires a lot of time. Therefore, most commercial finite element software provide a functionality of restarting the solution from the last solved substep. In the above example, the solution can be restarted from the 7th or 8th substep by doing the required changes needed to solve the remaining unsolved substeps. This can save a lot of time. ANSYS Solution Restart feature provides this functionality to restart the solution from any of the previously converged substeps with modified loads, boundary conditions, and the solution settings. This functionality is available in the static structural, transient structural, and the coupled field analysis.